drawings on here. I don't, I don't really know what you're talking about, man. You gotta tell me who it's from. Real inappropriate drawings on here. See you later. Hello. Yep, DHL delivery calling. I'm calling for what, Eric. What, who are you? Who are you delivering? Yep, Marcus, what is it? DH, there's drawings all Marcus over the place. Here. <laughs> what do you mean drawings? Unfreaking believable the drawings I'm seeing on this package. Yeah, all the drawings on skeletons and just anyway, we've been out there twice. There's a three time surcharge. I'm not paying anything, dude. You're not telling me what it is. Oh, I can tell you exactly what it is. There's skeletons oh, and skulls exactly. and a lot of inappropriate I stuff on here. Call. So here's the faggot now. Fuck you. Hello? Hello. It's Buddy Gripple calling. Yeah. And uh you know, what is the problem? What is the ordeal here? Well, I don't know who you're looking for or what your problem is, but it's not with me and not at this number. I'm a friend of Rusty Savages. That's fine. I don't know who Rusty Savage is either. And I saw you fussing with my shed and my levers. I don't know what your lever is or what shed you're talking about. You, uh, I saw you grab hold of that pivotal lever down there, and I need it back. I don't know what you're talking and about. And I need you to promise me this ain't going to happen again, partner. I ain't going to promise you nothing. Now, if you call here again, you'll be reported. Do you understand that? I'll promise you a bandaging if you don't provide it at okay. once, partner. You're going to hand it over. Let, let me ask you something. Who are you looking for? Let, let me ask you something. Who? I'm going to ask you this. No, we're going to remember. We're still going to go down. Hey, boss, we got well. Oh, Nicholas, leave your heart out. There ain't no Rusty Savage here. Hello, Vortex here. Hello. Good day. Hi. What's Business? happening? I'm Frederick Frick. I'm interested in entering into a gentleman's agreement with you. Uh-huh, yes, okay. What would this agreement entail? I'm a local band. Uh... We're called Wallet Size Wild Farms. <laughs> We're gnomes. And I think that really sets us apart. We're looking to get some distribution. Okay. Uh, no, I'm not up for it. Thanks. I'm sorry. I got to go now. We're Bye -bye. the only gnomes in the area. Uh, I don't know. I never heard of you guys. Who? What? I never even heard of you guys. Who? Lesbian or whatever. Yeah. Are you into that or something? What are you talking about, dude? What? What are you talking about, anyway? I never even heard of your band, man. Which band? Aren't you in a band? Yeah. Did you get... Hello? Hello? Do I need to rip off your face? Oh, uh, dude, Thanks, I gotta let Jensen. you go, man. What for, dude? Cause I told you I got a student in guitar lessons right now. Hey, can you play the saxophone for us tonight? That'll be good. <laughs> uh, yeah, I gotta let you go. Hey, wait, but... Jensen, let me ask you one more question, okay? Alright. Um, we're forming a new band. Uh-huh. And... Is there any way you could join that? We're called Saxophone Lesbian. No, I can't. Why not, dude? Because I got a killer band. Huh? You want me to kill your band? Yeah. I could do that with my fist out. alone, buddy. And that'd be your last mistake, mister. Oh, yeah? Uh, you'd never heard of Bobby, though, huh? No, why? He's a fucking killer drummer, man. I'm gonna drill my lower lip, my feet. Really? Well... How's that sound, buddy? It sounds just great, man. You crossed me on this. That's your last mistake, mister. No, but would you play Thrash Tambourine for us? Tonight? Yeah. We'll give uh, you 50 bucks. Say what? We'll give you 50 bucks. Oh, yeah? It's Broadway, yeah? Uh, no, I don't think so, bud. Mm, do I need to bring my cleats to your face? Once I kick you or what? I think you should just, uh... I don't know, find somebody else, man. I want you to listen to me, there was a man, he said to the good Lord, he said, I bless you, can I get her, amen, I said, hello, hello, yeah. okay, so I said, hello, hi, Jeremy, yes, hi, this is Bill Murray, how are you, Bill, it's good to hear your voice, same here, I'm in Chicago. I, I have a place in California. I got your number from Matt Dillon. And I got a charity uh, event coming up, and I wanted to invite you down. Well, I, unfortunately, this isn't Bill, but I wish it was. Oh, I am. I wish I wasn't sometimes, but... 
It's uh, for the Society for Prevention of Cruelty to Animals. I have a giant boxing ring that I've built. It's right off Mulholland Drive. And it's <clears throat> me, you, Chris Elliott. And we just get in there, beat the hell out of each other, and raise some money. <laughs> I think it's a great idea, man. You know what? Why don't you pencil me in for the 12th of Never? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. We've also got Cindy Lauper. <laughs> And Blythe Danner, they're going to get in there and just beat the hell out of each other. Raise a few dollars. Oh, that's great. Hold, hold, hold on one second, and then you're going to give me that minute and 18 seconds back. Hello? Hi, I'm Schrobel from Zatarain's Rise. I have no idea who you are and what you want. Do you want to tell me? Zatarain's, the rice cooker. I know nothing about it. Real spicy. Well, sorry, I'm not interested. But I have a note here to call you. Uh, you couldn't have a note to call me because I asked you to call me. Uh, Shlobo Nix? No. That's my name? No. Uh, Hello? Yes. There you go. That, that's the person you should be calling, I guess. I'm sort of a phenom when it comes to cooking. Am I in the right place? No, I didn't call you. So somebody's screwing around with the phones, I think. Is there some sort of flip that needs to happen? I, I have no idea. Somebody has managed to jerk the phone system around so that two or three people are called at the same time and are told that they were calling somebody else and it just it, I wish I could explain it to you but uh, somebody's having fun at our expense well what do you have to say about Zatarain I don't know anything about it it's a spicy uh, concoction it's full of character well I don't care real flavorful oh yeah, this is Buddy over at United Parcel Service. Yeah, what I'm are you guys doing? I'm the supervisor out here. Uh, you tell your goddamn people not to harass me over the phone if you're going to bring something out to me. We got a 420-pound octopus coming I to you. I have no idea what the hell you're talking about. What kind of octopus? That's fine. Bring it over. I don't know where the hell you're going to put it. Now, did Clint tell you we need a check from you? What? Fuck you. Did, did Clint notify we are authorized to strike you if we have to? Now, <laughs> oh, I have no idea. Hi, I'm Jess. What can I do for you? Arthur, my name is Ruby, and I understand you want to make a donation to the Jewish Wall Zetron? You know, I don't know where you people are getting this crap from. I don't know where you're getting our telephone number, because this is a news desk, a crying news desk. Sir, whoever put you on the phone was called up. We did not call you, sir. Whoever the gentleman was that transferred the call to you, ah! he was the one that put you Shit! on the phone. Shit! Now, this is a second it's the PB! Call. It's a new people. PB! It's not a 600K. So, okay. so that kind Thank of breaks my heart. It. But I got the PB! Hey, Just now! This is the police line, you oh, yeah. stupid bitch. Oh, yeah! Sweet! Hello. Is this Mike? Yeah. Hey, hello. Avery told me to contact you. Oh, okay. Uh, I was so My fucking close Matt to 600k, Lopez. though. Okay. If and, only. What, and what? What is uh, your full name? Michael Schlepper. How do you spell that last name? Oh, uh, what did uh, Avery tell you to contact oh, me about? That. that he wanted to give a donation to the Polish Legion American veterans. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm not working right now, so I can't do any donations. Okay, that's all right with me. It's just that we're telling him not to give his money away like that.